or whatever. But I want to set the record straight because I know there's been some lies told and uh, some things that hadn't been said that went on that, that uh, they didn't tell about. Uh, they was telling their side of the story, I'm sure, and uh, uh, it was probably incorrect if they did tell their side or our side of the story. Anyway, I had, I'd been single, single for 16 years after going through a bad divorce. Uh, we've had we had four girls and. Uh, I worked as an electrical tech for 26 years and been single for 16 of them when I decided to get married again. Well, back in uh, my other, where I got the divorce at, I was, uh, I, I'm not saying that I wasn't at fault uh, partially, but uh, I had some problems that I was working, trying to work out uh, and they just, I, I couldn't work them out. I couldn't get my wife to change what she was doing. So uh, I had to finally file for divorce. Uh, I got custody of the children and uh, I did the best I could for them. Uh, I even sent them to college, but that didn't work out. They didn't stay in college about six months. And uh, I was out all that money to get them started into college but I tried to get get them the best start that I could you know uh, but uh, I'd been single for 16 years and I decided to get married again uh, I didn't want to live by myself I wanted somebody there uh, with me and uh, uh, Everything was going well after I got married until one day the girls were coming over to visit. And uh, this is when COVID was here and uh, we were staying at home mostly. And if we did go anywhere, we wore masks. And uh, we told the girls that uh, they would have to wear masks when they come come over. And uh, <laughs> they didn't, uh, uh, it didn't work out too well. If if we if we ever went anywhere, though, we wore masks and we told the girls they'd have to when they came over. So with that, uh, when they came over, it was just a few minutes. We had went outside and they decided they wanted to take their mask off. Well... They knew the rules if they came over and they had to wear a mask while they were here. My wife asked uh, one of my daughters to put her mask back on. She decided she didn't want to wear one. And uh, that didn't go over too well. My wife asked her again. She said no. Well, needless to say, that didn't go over well at all. Uh, it escalated into a big argument, and uh, both the girls left, and I hadn't talked to them since. And uh, I'll stand by my wife on this because I know she was right. Unless my girls find a way of mending things with my wife, uh, we'll never have another meaning, meaningful relationship. And uh, I always hold my ground to that as well. Uh, my my kids have sent me some text and stuff and said that uh, I was uh, I wasn't. Uh, that I had uh, mistreated them when they were growing up and stuff, which I, I never did do. I always tried to do whatever I could for them, you know, try to help them. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm 66 years old now, and I don't 
I can't deal with that drama that they've got that they carry with them and uh, I'm not going to so uh, my wife and I have got along really good since then and uh, maybe they didn't care as much as I thought you know about me but uh, they've not tried to mend things with my wife yet I don't know why I did all I could for them while I was raising them and uh, I know that I wasn't perfect but they don't come with instructions and uh, I did the best I could when uh, me and my other wife split up, divorced, uh, I, 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 I'd done some wrong things, I was bad, I, I, I won't disagree with that but uh she was too and uh you know i went to get help because i knew that uh that i was doing wrong uh i was an alcoholic and i uh, went and got help and when i did get help i i started taking them kids to church and and seeing that they were baptized i don't know whether that helped or not but I thought I would do something to try to help them along because after them taking uh, their mother and and learning from her, I I wanted them to have a a good life and and I don't think that well I guess they are having a good life I don't know but uh, I'm not going to let them ruin my life I can tell you that. Uh, but I can tell you one thing, I didn't teach them to lie. I taught them to try to be good to people and not lie. And I tried to teach them things that would help them out in life. And uh, I don't know whether it worked or not. Uh, they seem to be doing pretty good right now, but uh, uh, they would have to be honest with me from now on you know, without the line. They can they can leave the line at home. Uh, but uh, I've been uh, sober for over 20 years now and uh, I changed my life before I ever got divorced. Uh, I quit and I thought my wife would fall in there, my ex-wife, I thought she'd fall in there and and uh, do better, but she never did. She didn't. She didn't do any better. So I went ahead and filed for divorce. And then, uh, but my wife now. I've got a good wife now, and she she treats me right. And uh, I couldn't ask for any better. And uh, but uh, I'll stand behind her on these kids, and and uh, I just won't let them. Uh, fall in between me and her uh, I just don't see that that would be right and uh, you know what them kids I know they've tried every way in the world to split us up but it won't work I promise you it won't uh, they've called here and said that I was going out and stuff like that and I know they have uh, I know they was behind it they can't tell me that they weren't and uh but anyway uh i wanted to let y'all know and how that is and i don't know whether y'all have ever been through anything like that or not it's not a good thing uh, uh it's bad to have to go through and i'm not saying that i don't love them but i just i'd rather leave them alone as I had to listen to their lies or have them try to break me and my wife up or try to create drama and uh, go against our rules as long as they're here. Now, if I was at their house, uh, I would follow their rules as long as it wasn't nothing that... Uh, 
I didn't want to do, and if I, if it was something I want didn't want to do, I'd just leave. You know, I wouldn't sit there and argue with them about the rules. They knew the rules when they come over here. You know, but uh, that's what that's what's happened with me and uh, me and my girls, and uh, that's just the way it is. And you know, my wife bent over backwards to try to help them and it don't seem like it did any good it, it made things worse matter of fact i don't know I, I don't know about these kids nowadays i don't know what they're thinking i don't know what's going through their mind but like i say you know uh i still love them but i, I can i can do without them you know it's love's a choice and regardless of whether it's your family or not if you decide to to leave them alone, leave them alone. If they got drama in their life or they do things that you don't see is right, uh, I don't see a problem with leaving them alone. I'm not going to sit there and argue and fuss with them. I'm not going to sit there and tell them. I tell them they're doing wrong. Yeah, I don't think they're doing right, which I don't. And, you know, everybody's got their opinion and their it's free world. You can tell them what you want to tell them, it, as long as you feel that it's right. And I don't think that's wrong at all. And uh, I mean, it seemed like your family hurt you worse than the ones that aren't even close to you. You know. Uh, but you know, I know y'all probably don't care about this and I hope this don't never happen to you but if it does it's nothing wrong with leading your own life the way you want to live and that's that's the way this world is it's a free country and if you don't want to hear the bull crap just don't stay there with it leave them alone tell them to leave that's all you got to do. And, you know, like I say, whether it's your family or not, and I, I'm going to tell you something, your family will do it to you a lot faster than somebody else would. But uh, thank you for tuning in and watching. Uh, I hope you all have a great day.